Offering time. Blessing time. The Lord is good. And all the time. The Lord is good. Our reading this morning is from Psalm 116, verse 12 to 14. It says, What shall I render to the Lord for all his benefits towards me? I will take up the cup of salvation. I will call and call upon the name of the Lord. I will pay my vows to the Lord now in the presence of all his people. Praise his holy name. Four things come out from this. He says he understands God has blessed him that the psalmist is talking about. But because of this, he's going to pick up or take up his cup of salvation. That's acknowledge and accept what Jesus has done for us. He has justified us. He sanctified us. He has redeemed us. He has delivered us. And he has forgiven us for all our sins. The second thing he said here is, I will call upon the name of the Lord. That is, his hope is in the Lord, the God everlasting God, for his faithfulness, and he will depend on God. And the fourth, third thing he said, he said, I will pay my vows, talking about what will I render to the Lord for all his benefits toward me. He said, the third thing he said, I will pay my vows. What does it mean to pay your vows? It's to respond to God's goodness by giving offerings, tithes, worshipping, being obedient, <clears throat> doing what he has called us to do. And when we do that in the presence of his people, we encourage one another. That is what the psalmist is saying. It says, what will I render to the Lord for all his benefits? And the next verse tells us what he will do. I hope each one of us will pick, take up our cup of salvation, depend on him, pay our vows in the presence of the congregation. Offering time. Blessing time. The Lord is good. And all the time. The Lord is good. Let's pay our vows.